Hi, I'm Steven with MikeReynolds.com, and today we're talking about the AKG C214. Now, today we'll talk about the general specs of the 214, uh, how it compares to the C414, and the 214's most popular uses. Now, in general, the AKG C214 is a large diaphragm condenser that utilizes a cardioid pickup pattern. This is considerably different than the 414. Although the 414 is also a large diaphragm condenser, it has nine different pickup patterns. Both the 214 and the 414 have the same frequency response, 20 hertz to 20k, so that's the full spectrum. Uh, but the 214 has a better presence peak in the frequency response for a better lead vocal recording. Now when it comes to SPL rating, the 214 is rated for 136 dB without the pre-attenuation pad on but it's rated at 156 dB with the pad on, so it only has two settings. The 414 has a four position switch that allows the pad to step down six dBs each time. Uh, so it goes from 136 dB up to 158 dB. Now, another difference between the 214 and the 414 is the low cut filter. Now the C214 only has one setting. So when you hit the switch on the side, that actually cuts the frequency response at 300 hertz, believe it or not. So that's, that's pretty high for a low cut filter. But on the 414, uh, it's a four position switch. So that cuts it at 40, 80, 60, and 160 hertz. For a more in-depth look at the C414, uh, go ahead and check out a blog that we did earlier. Of all the uses the AKG C214 has, we find that a lot of our customers rent these mics as a great alternative for uh, guitar amp mics as well as drum overhead mics. Now the 214 is built rugged enough for both studio recording and live environments. But just because it's built for both environments doesn't mean it's a good choice for both. For instance, the 214 is great for studio recording lead vocals, whether singing or doing voiceovers, but not on stage. The 214 would serve better as a background vocal mic or group vocal mic if it was selected for the live environment. Now, in addition to these uses, you can use the 214 for practically any instrument, but I would advise to keep the mic away from loud snare drums. Dynamic mics are best for use for a high SPL instrument like that. At MikeReynolds.com, we have these available to rent, and they also come with a windscreen and a shock mount. They're also part of the AKG Premium Drum Mic Kit, and they're also available as stereo pairs and can be used as room or audience mics, or even for miking a grand piano or Leslie cabinet. Well, I think that wraps it up on the AKG C214. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Steven with MikeReynolds.com.